Yo, long time no see, enough talk. Let's get right into it. It's been around three weeks since I have last posted videos on CFP25, NCAA Football 25, whatever you want to call it. Rico Ricardo is back at it with another game. And today it's very important because guess what? We are playing against none other than Alabama Crimson Tide for the SEC Championship. So therefore, this game has got to be a victory for us we have got to secure the bag we have got to secure this w okay and so we have to put on those black jerseys because we are about to just straight up murder somebody right now on the field okay and so here we go alabama versus georgia who would have thought this matchup would come to life this year who would have thought we would be matched up with one of the top teams in recent years that's crazy, okay? With that being said, ladies and gentlemen, I know I have been missing for quite some time, but look at that boy right there in the all black number nine. He is ready to do some dirty damage, okay? So with that being said, securing our first position in the college football playoffs this year, let's see if we can capture ourselves our first dub in the playoffs. So with that being said, starting off flip second and nine. So that wasn't really a promising start that I would have hoped for, but at least we got a whole lot of time to fix that. Okay, so with that being said, running this play right here, here I go, catching the ball, my first reception. And of course, I was so close to having that first down on lock but guess what i secured the first down and oh had i broken more tackles i could have sworn i would have ran off for a touchdown but guess what at least i got first down though at least i got first down okay so moving down third and six and one of my receivers got the ball and he is about to go ahead and get our first down again so close to catching the touchdown but you know what it's all good and so first time getting off of the field and now heading into the bench already and so moving on to a few plays later and so the game is already close 7 to 10 Alabama is leading this game by three points and so here is where things are looking a little bit you know tight as in like we are in a tight position to the point where the game is getting close already and so a three-point game this is really not what I was expecting, but since it's Alabama, I guess I can see why this was, you know, happening in the first place. But you know what? We're going to try to fix this regardless, okay? And so my receiver down here is getting tons of yards being lost. And so third and 12, this is not looking good so far. I can't believe we are literally struggling to make a play happen. We are struggling to make magic happen, okay? Now, here's the thing, folks. Alabama, I never thought I would come across a team this powerful, especially when they're playing on defense, okay? On the defensive end, they are so powerful as of right now to the point where it makes us look like we are struggling to make these plays because we are looking a bit starstruck right now. And of course, taking forever to pick a play is one of my biggest issues with this game thus far. I mentioned this before in my review. Go and watch it if you haven't already. And so, EA, you guys have to fix this ASAP, I, I promise you they have to fix this but anyway look at me almost getting your fumble but luckily we did we get the ball did we get the ball i don't know what happened but um yeah okay so we did get the ball back okay so it's our ball still luckily i got the fumble or somebody on my team got the ball back after that and here we go again this time is an interception so the other team Ended up getting a pick six from us. And so now the score is 7 to 13. Moving on, moving on. Now the score is 7 to 20. So this is where the game is getting a little bit too out of hand because we are over here. Like I said, we are struggling to make a lot of plays happen because Alabama's defense is literally no joke. Look at how much damage they're doing to us right now. Okay, look how much damage they're doing to us. 7 to 27. How insane is this? We are down by 20 points. We have to make a comeback or else our dreams might get shattered for not making further into the playoffs because we have got to hang on tight into this game because I do not feel like trying to lose right now because we have got to advance to the playoffs if we're going to make this 
career happened, but guess what? Another flag was called, but thankfully, it's on them. Thankfully, it is on the other team. And so, we accepted this flag on a play, this penalty, whatever you want to call it. So, now it is still first down, so we get an extra chance. And one of my receivers, number one, you know, put some yards in, but it is still not enough. Okay, so running this play right here for second and nine, my quarterback clearly saw the other guy. And luckily, we got a first down from it, okay? And so, another break, getting back on the bench. And so, Alabama scores more points again. We are still struggling, heading into the fourth quarter. And just like that, we lost the game. 31-55. to 55. I barely got a chance to play on that game. I barely got a chance to be on the field, rather for the majority of the game, which sucks because I literally wanted to show out, especially for a championship game like this for our conference. I wanted us to pop out and really stand on business, bro. But at least I got this one highlight right here. And so, man, I, we were so close to like 31 to 55. It was a bit of a, you know, close game in a sense, but even then, Alabama's defense, like I said, they were not joking this game. They really came out and showed out. Oh my goodness, bro. So, with that being said, the final score, um, there you guys go. 31-55. to 55. If we get kicked out of the playoffs, that might suck. But anyway, look at this here. Jalen Milrow, whoever this is, won the Heisman. I didn't even get the Heisman, despite trying my hardest thus far in the season. But at least I get freshman all sec or SEC, whatever. Hooray, bro. Um, but what's this? Hold up. We get a second chance against NC State. Hold on. There might be a bit of hope after all. NC State versus Georgia, the college football playoffs. So our dreams might not be shattered, but we have got to do better at the same time, okay? If we're going to pull this off, we have got to do better. So in order to do that, we have got to hit the practice drills, okay? Specifically the rack attack. I haven't done one of these in a minute. And so here I am coming back into this practice drill after a while, it seems like. And it feels so refreshing to do this each and every time because every time I do this drill in particular, I get better and better. And so this helps me out like every single step of the way, if that makes sense. So here we go. Yours truly just juking these boys out and about just doing his own thing. You know what I mean? And so Ricardo is not going to give up on this season. I promise you. We are trying to strive, people. We are trying to literally get our team together for this playoff season because once my team gets a lot stronger before the nc state game it will be over okay so we have got to pull this victory off next game so with that being said eighteen thousand as i expected but i don't really care as long as i make progress that's all i care about at the end of the day so with that being said that is a quick episode for you guys just a quick one so with that being said i am back on the road to glory like this video if you want to see more please give this video a like please run the views up subscribe if you are new to the channel comment down below what you want to see next and i'm out